have this. We're going to have this to start off with this grip here. Cross grip in the sleeve, right? And uh, it's a better way you pick, and, you pick and choose this grip instead that uh, that's what is left for me now. You start off instead of, I get this cross grip, get this here and set down guard. Or I, once I lay my back on the ground, bring my, bring my knees to my chest. Once I start engaging, go like this, water weight. One thing that you have to be aware of. I cannot leave this leg here the same we did for the last one because now he has that grip he can use. Oh, yep. What you want to do is uh, get the leg in the shoulder or sometimes we're going to have it even like this, hide the foot like this. But just don't leave the foot here. It seems for him to manipulate the foot. He can even throw my leg for this, this way here for leg drag, which works really well for this. Or I'm going to have my legs like this hooking his hip to make sure that he cannot manipulate my foot the way that he wants, extend my leg. Or shoulder is a good option too, like this. It's possible for him to start control my foot, but it makes, give me time to settle my guard. Don't stand. Okay, once I have this, I'm gonna drop this leg quick here, and I'm gonna do the same position. Because once I, put, once I bridge it, put the weight on this leg, it's heavier, it's hard for him to manipulate my foot. If it goes like this, you guys will stand, it's hard in there, in the leg. Now, you guys gonna do the same thing, feed this leg here, but once I have this one here, this one comes right behind his knee water way. I'm still bridging, look it. I'm not dropping my weight, I'm not chasing his back. Now, once I feed this foot right behind his knee, I'm gonna pull the far one and push the near one. This here. Now I'm gonna pull his butt torso my, my stomach, get the arm around the neck as soon as possible. A lot of times the armor on the neck is going to come before the hooks. But send because it's going to land like this. It's going to be tough to get the hooks. It's going to peel the hooks out. But if you start, you got to hold with his neck. He has something more to be concerned. Yes, got it? Yes, okay. You got cross grip. You start from this. I go. I water away. Look, my this leg goes this, this one goes. Eighty percent of the back takes gonna come from my hooks. It's not me hopping to my butt. I see a lot of times you go like this. It doesn't work as much. You slow. You go this, and you start to this. You know, the bridging is gonna help shift the the weight like we did the last one uh, on Tuesday to go bridge to sit up this way. And it's gonna help for you to take his back too. You understand? Still bridge apart, bridging, get the hooks there, and drop your weight. Any questions? Let's go, guys. Well, it's a pick and choose. You can bridge to take the back, or you can settle the, the hooks with the grip that you're uh, we, working today. But hook behind the knee, you can go. But the difference for this, uh, I cannot use the same sweep, right? From, from under. Sir. Oh, excuse me, for choose for the same, the first flip. I'm not gonna even move him for the first flip. I cannot sit, sit like this. Because pulling that sleeve helps a lot to fall him to the side. I cannot use this. But I, one detail, I did a mention today, and uh, but I we emphasize a lot on choosing. Now he's trapped, right? He's, he's stuck in my, in my De La Hit, full De La Hit. It's a feeling process right now. Feels like he's gonna move, I was gonna defend. If he's sitting there, he put his weight in the far knee, I'm gonna be patient to maintain this. I'm a, I'm dictating right now. Right? Control him. And he's defending. When he mistake, he can can come out. I have to feel how he's put his weight. But if I can choose, what's if he stands like this? If he stands like this, I have a good control, I can stop moving him. When I move him, I'm gonna grab the belt and gonna blow the weight on top of me. Whatever side he falls over this side here, I can take it. The only place I cannot take him, it's over here. Right, because that base there. But this way, on this way here, I, I can take him. Because then you guys can drill and every drill can be different. Depends how he's gonna fall. Got it? Turn this way, look. And maintain that, it's, it's, it's weird it feels, 
but I'm saying that hooks you are gonna save you for a lot of positions can try on you but also don't give time for him to settle any guard he's trapped Sorry. here Mateen, until the end, it's going to be easy for you to land on top of him. Don't let it go a hook, straight chaos. No, you dare control it. Mateen, until the end. Yes, goes. Here, hold tight. Control him. To stay on your mark. I'm not moving him, but I'm, I'm, I'm going to make sure that he cannot come out. Still hold the pants. Right? Quick transition. Don't, if, you, if one hand is doing nothing, you do something wrong. If I'm like this, something's wrong. Uh oh, come out. Right? If I'm like this, uh oh, come out. But every time that I, you have my, my grips, doesn't matter if two sleeves, pants sleeve, if you try attempt to push my leg, try move, show him the solution. Huh? <laughs> yeah? That's, yeah, you control it. Every time, move your leg now. So I try to move. Push, push. Oh, see, he indeed to feel trapped. He needs to feel off balance. Try to get this foot in my foot there to push down. No, he can't. He's gonna have to move. But the, again, quick transition. Oh, this here. Now load the weight. If he goes, goes back more. Look, look, that way. Oh, take him this way. I'm gonna follow him. Watch my my hook. Hook come out. The top one come out, the bottom one's still there. <coughs> Make sure he's not gonna trap the leg and a half. If I let it go this one, uh oh, it's this one. But if I take this one, he cannot trap the leg. Oh. It turned this way. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Whatever side that he takes, you can follow him. Because Montana is solid, Villa Hill. And like I said, every drill probably gonna do depends on how it falls, it's gonna, be, it's gonna come up cheaper. But if Montana hooks, the end is going to be the same. Any questions? Yeah, just one more time, please. From this, same thing, drop quick. Never drop, don't do nothing. If I'm here, I'm already bridging already. Which is making more pressure, hard for me to fill this foot out. Go. Yes, sir. Do this here. Leg extend when I have to, have to extend. Pull if I have to pull. <coughs> This way here. One, one detail you, have, you can apply here, if you can find bows on the hooks, even better, get bows on. Cool. Yes, sir. Let's go, let's go up. 